I'm Raf Hymas. Today we are presenting the Massey Ferguson 6S. The 6S has a wide variety of applications. In fact, the, the list is almost endless, but because of its size and its horsepower and its capability, it's ideally suited for your haymaking operations, baling, cutting hay, all of that type of thing, ideally suited. It shares a great deal of features with its big brother, the 7S, but in a more compact, maneuverable package. And that maneuverability is down to really one key feature, and that is the 4.9 litre, four cylinder, Agco power engine. Let's have a look under the bonnet. With the Dyna VT, in addition to its seamless performance, it also has the added benefit of having a separate reservoir for your transmission oil and your hydraulic oil, which dramatically lowers the chance of cross-contamination between those components. So whether the bonnet is open or closed, uh, you can do all of your daily checks from this side of the engine. So toward the back, there's the engine oil dipstick, uh, up at the top, you've got your coolant reservoir, and then right up at the front, in front of the cooling package, you've got your uh, air filtration system here. So as you can see, really easy access to the air cleaner. Just remove the cover there, uh, unlatch the filter, and that pulls out to the side. And really easy to slip back in and close that cover up once it's been cleaned. So on this particular unit, we can see uh, it's fitted with the optional front linkage and PDO. Front linkage has a capacity, a lift capacity of 3.2 ton. Uh, front PDO, as you can see, a single set of hydraulic remotes uh, there also, because this machine is, is fitted with the front end loader. So along with the front linkage, PDO, and your single set of hydraulic remotes, down here on the left-hand side of the tractor, you will see your external controls for the linkage, lifting and lowering via the buttons there. As you see, this unit is fitted with the FL4323 loader. One advantage now that we've got to offer to the market is the fact that we can have our loaders fitted from the factory, which will really simplify uh, the pre-delivery process, um, stocking levels, all that sort of thing, and just make it a much more seamless experience for our customers. And with any front-end loaders that Agco supplies on the S-Series tractor, you have a soft ride, and your third function included as standard. So, significant fuel capacity on the 6S. Main diesel tank, 267 litres. And then the AdBlue tank, 40.9 litres of AdBlue. So, nice high capacities for a good long working day. With the 6S, there are a choice of two transmissions, either the Dyna 6 power shift, which is well known, and the very well respected Dyna VT. This unit behind me is fitted with the Dyna VT, which gives you a top speed of 50 kilometers an hour. And that also incorporates the quad link front axle suspension. And like all Massey Ferguson's front suspensions, it is maintenance free. So you'll notice on this model behind me, we have the LED option, the full LED option. So that gives you eight work lights around the top of the cab, two on the pillars, one left and right, and then another two on the rear fenders at the back. So that gives you a total of 12 for outstanding illumination and visibility. The 6S power plant meets European stage five emissions. The key feature that we benefit from here is the fact that it's an all-in-one system. All of those components are housed very compactly right here. And you'll notice the very slender exhaust pipe that's tucked right behind the A pillar, which gives you outstanding forward visibility. At the rear of the tractor, obviously, we've got our three-point linkage, our hydraulic functions, PDO. On the Dyna VT, we have 190 litres per minute hydraulic flow. We have a rear lift capacity of 9,600 kilos. We have a three-speed PTO. We have four remotes, each of them with the decompression lever. 
which assists with connecting and disconnecting implements. We've also got ISOBUS, hydraulic power beyond, and hydraulic trailer brake fitted to this unit. When we talk about operator comfort, we've got our front, ax front axle su suspension that we mentioned earlier. In conjunction with that feature, we've also got mechanical cab suspension, which just adds that comfort and control uh, for a long working day. So for convenience, on the exterior, we've got a, a number of controls on the rear fenders. On both sides, you've got the ability to lift and lower your rear linkage. You've got control of one set of hydraulic remotes, and then you've also got the ability to activate and deactivate your PDO from outside on the rear guard. So let's have a look at the cab of the 6S. So the current S series from Massey Ferguson has a huge amount of consistency throughout the whole range. So when you look at the cab of the 6S, you'll see familiarities across the, the whole range. Starting from the steering wheel, we have minor things like the chrome spokes on the steering wheel, which, is, which denotes the efficient or exclusive specification. We've got the, the unique Massey Ferguson power control lever. So it's a four in one function. We can shift forward and reverse, shift up and down the transmission ratios. Got a fairly standard dashboard in front of us. And then moving across to the other side here, we've got both the Datatronic 5 and the Fieldstar 5. Difference between the two screens. The Datatronic basically does all of your functions. It can do your all of your tractor functions, your hydraulics, your linkage, your transmission, all of the tractor functions, but it can also do your guidance and ISOBUS. If you prefer to have two screens, you can assign your guidance and ISOBUS functions to the Fieldstar 5, which leaves your Datatronic 5 solely for your, trans for your tractor functions. But if you prefer to just have one screen, you can do everything off the Datatronic 5. We mentioned earlier the, the all-in-one emissions control and that narrow exhaust. From inside the cab, you can basically not even see the exhaust. It, the, the, the forward visibility is outstanding. That, that exhaust uh, stack and the emission control don't block your, your, your view in any way at all. We're starting to see that family feel throughout the whole range. So starting with the 8S, then the new armrest that was in the 8S is, is now starting to, to be seen in the rest of the range. The 6S, the armrest layout is pretty much identical. So starting from left to right, we've got our hand throttle. You've got your preset engine speeds, your um, transmission functions, your multi-function lever. So your forward and reverse, your range change your your cruise control one and two your micro joystick here forward and reverse shuttle all on the 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 transmission lever there to the right we have our multi-function joystick which in normal function just operates the loader but you can you can assign another hydraulic function to the h3 or h4 you can also do your forward and reverse shuttle you can you can uh, up and downshift, and you've also got a essentially multi-purpose function key that you can assign to more or less anything, including answering your phone if you wish. Down through the rest of the console, we'll see your diff lock function. So you can lock it manually, or you can have your auto diff lock engaged. Same with four-wheel drive. You can activate four-wheel drive manually, or you can activate auto four-wheel drive. Your hydraulic unlock um, auto PDO, your linkage position control here on the dial, your telephone and, and Bluetooth functions here, as well as your um, audio functions, front PDO, rear PDO. As this machine is an efficient spec, we have two of our four hydraulic remotes operated on the joystick here. You can assign it through the Datatronic 5 screen. We also then have the third and fourth remote over here on the console on the fingertip controls. 
Coming down the, the B pillar, we've got all of our lighting controls for our work lights. You've got your PDO functions, and then your, also your rear linkage adjustments. You've got your rear linkage uh, suspension. Um, and then down through here, your hazard and hazard lights, you can lock out your loader function. Uh, one of the key th key features I feel that's that's come on with the new S series range is the fact that we now have a dedicated button for the brake to neutral function. We can lock out our front suspension uh, through this key here. We can activate our ISO bus um, and all of those functions there on the B pillar. Down here we have a USB port and then your rear linkage lift and lower function on the button there. This is our auto air suspension seat. So it automatically adjusts to your body weight. You've got a myriad of adjustments on it, fore and aft, your backrest, you've got adjustable armrests, you name it, it's on this seat. Just a very comfortable place to, to spend a long working day. This particular unit is fitted with a Trimble receiver and auto guide from the factory. All of those controls, as we've mentioned, can be done through your Datatronic 5 screen uh, or your Fieldstar 5 screen. It's also equipped with MF Connect, which is a very exciting um, feature. It allows you as the customer to monitor the whereabouts of your machine, the performance of the machine. It also allows the dealer to, to, to closely monitor what the machine's doing. It can help with preemptive maintenance and Probably most importantly, that MF Connect currently comes with a free five-year subscription. So I hope you've enjoyed our presentation of the Massey Ferguson 6S today. It really is the perfect balance of power, agility, and performance. If you'd like to know more, please visit our website or contact your local Massey Ferguson dealership.